This morning, Chad Dorman, the Claremont County father accused of killing his three sons last summer, is expected to be in court. Fox 19 now's Taylor Davis is outside the courthouse right now. Taylor, this is a story we've been covering since the day it happened. We know the community has really rallied around that family. What are we expecting to happen today? So this morning at 10 a.m., they are expecting to discuss this motion of suppress, which was filed by Dorman's lawyers. And so what they want is to try to get certain parts of evidence uh, thrown out so it won't be used in the trial. So what they are arguing is they're arguing that Claremont County Sheriff deputies interrogated him for hours and ignored his request for a lawyer. They also say that uh, there were some recorded interviews with medical personnel that they they say should have not been recorded. Now, they also are asking that any statements he made to medical personnel while deputies were there also not be used along with other things written out in this motion. Now, you might remember Claremont County deputy said he admitted to killing his three sons, four-year-old Hunter, seven-year-old Clayton, and three-year-old Chase at their home last year. And however, despite admitting this to deputies, he has decided to plead not guilty. Now, again, this is something that rattled the community. It put everyone in shock, but everyone kind of rallied around this mother after this happened. Take a listen to what people had to say last year. I would never imagine someone that I went to high school with, middle school, elementary, nothing, doing something like that. It kind of hits, hits a little bit harder and closer to home when it's someone that you, that you knew that you went to school with. Still very, very sad. Now, if this motion is granted, that means certain pieces of this evidence could be excluded, but that's something that we're going to find out here at 10 a.m. We will be streaming it live on air. Taylor Davis, Fox 19 Now.